Hello everyone, I am Leonardo. In this video, I am demonstrating how to use the interactive lighter with advanced frame asset and its properties. So let's jump into it. First, open up the interactive lighter asset. Go to interactive lighter folder and migrate the blueprint folder to your project content directory. Now, for the demonstration, I am going to create a simple character blueprint and a game mode in this player directory. Now I set up the game mode to use this player blueprint as default pawn and set the world setting to use the player game mode that we just created. Now let's just quickly set up the player blueprint by adding a spring arm, a camera and a scene component. Make scene component the child of capsule component and set its location to 0, 0, 0 in x, y and z and scale to 10, 10, 10 respectively. Now go to event graph and spawn the lighter blueprint. Set its spawn transform from the scene component world transform and promote the spawn lighter to a variable. Attach lighter blueprint with the player actor and set location rule to keep world. I already set up the input events, so let's quickly set up the controls for player movement. Search for get control rotation and extract the z axis. Make rotator, connect the yaw, get forward vector and get right vector and put it in the world direction respectively. Now movement control is done. Now we set up the lighter. Grab keyboard E, R and space bar key. Get the lighter variable and call open lighter, close lighter and ignite lighter functions as follows. Now let's see the result. Looking good. Now let's see the properties of this asset. Color which changes the paint color. The 
dirt color which changes the color of the dirt. Paint roughness controls the roughness of paint. Dirt roughness control the roughness of the dirt. Light area radius which controls the attenuation radius of the light. Play max rotation which control the amount of rotation happen when the lighter moves. Minimum intensity controls the intensity of light while moving. Maximum intensity controls the intensity of light while not moving. Max flickering control the amount of flickering of light while moving. Min flicker control the amount of flickering of light while not moving. And that's it. Now if you like this asset, please check out the playable demo. The link is in the description. If you are interested, this asset is available in the Unreal Engine marketplace. The link is also in the description. Have a nice day. Thanks for watching.